He joins us after talking to Josh Shapiro this Tuesday. He is Pennsylvania's current attorney general who is the Democratic candidate for governor. So, Ethan, this will be a very closely watched race in the nation. What did you learn from Shapiro earlier today? Mike and Eva, we often get just a handful of moments to pepper a candidate with questions, trying to get answers for our viewers. So when we get a sit down interview like we did today, we made the most of it, asking Shapiro a wide range of questions about the issues facing our region. We asked him an awful lot, getting his stances on everything from agriculture to policing and the economy. We also asked what he can do to work with Republicans, because if he's elected, he is almost certain to have to work with a Republican-controlled state legislature. Shapiro says he's cognizant of that, and so his agenda is focused on issues that he thinks have broad support across the aisle. We've got to cut costs for businesses and individuals, invest in economic development, make sure everybody's connected to the Internet at high-speed affordable rates. We've got to hire 2,000 police officers to make sure our communities are safe and people feel safe. As Election Day approaches, we're profiling every candidate in major races at the national, the state, even the local level, telling you where they all stand on the issue so you are an informed voter. Thursday night at 6, we'll profile Josh Shapiro in our ongoing series, Where Do They Stand? Ethan Kibbe, Erie News Now.